your picture. <laughs> <laughs> I know you guys are sick of me. Welcome back to my channel. Um, so today's vlog is going to be a, a narrow vlog. So I hope that you guys enjoyed my previous video that I did of my time in Kyoto. If you haven't seen that, I will leave it in the card above or in the description box below. So check it out. So I just arrived not too long ago at my hotel in Nara and this hotel i'm going to be staying here for two nights i'm going to be going to a few places in nara of course you'll see that don't forget to like comment share and subscribe if you are new here join the family like and comment to let me know that you're here and turn on your post notification bell so that you can be notified whenever i have a new upload i want to show you guys the room before it gets more messy than it already is right now so i'm gonna go ahead and do a room tour so i'm gonna let you watch that and the next time you see me will be tomorrow when it's brighter and i am not in the same clothes that you you saw me in the closing of the last video so let's get into the room tour <laughs> day of our nara video before i leave out which i should have done a while a long time ago i want to pop on here to give you guys my outfit of the day no one asked for it but you're gonna get it you're welcome <laughs> all right so this is my little fit for the day wearing my beret because honestly it's cute one and two i'm trying to cover my lace because it, it's not in the best condition right now so we're gonna you know put it on keep it cute keep it classy and i have this top here from uniqlo this skirt from shein this tights i got from my mega don quixote uh purchase that i showed you guys in uh the preparation video and these shoes are some shoes i think these are from fashion nova so that's that gonna wear my coat and my bag and my tripod over here so we're gonna go to the nara park and then we're gonna do a few other activities in the area so let's go 
Hey guys, so made it to the park and I am seeing a lot of deers and I'm not going to lie I am a little bit not terrified um, But these deers do have a reputation of being a little on the aggressive side One of my friends told me that I should be careful because sometimes they'll eat at your clothes and Suggested also that I try to find deers in isolation because they tend to be even more aggressive when they're in packs so I'm going to go to the temple first and then ease my way into getting um, closer to the deers I let me see how far I am from the temple okay so I'm going to check in back with you guys after I don't know I'll check in back with you guys when I get to the temple I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys some b-roll there are deers crossing the pedestrian that is so cool i've never seen deer in person um so i'm excited to try or to have this experience for the very first time i'll be by myself about my cookies but I had to stack um, stash them in my bag because the rain the de what about to say the reindeer the deer are like really aggressive once they find out that you have cookie um, a little boy had to retreat inside the store <laughs> um, so I'm going to keep it until I get closer to the point where there are not so many and then I'll attempt to feed one or a few of them
I'm leaving the Todaiji temple and I'm headed to somewhere else. I don't know the name, I'll pop it up on the screen probably. I'll definitely leave my itinerary in the description box below. I'm hungry, so I'm headed to try out some street food. So come along. It's matcha with anko in the middle. It was so good. I got two. So I'm going to head to lunch and then afterwards we're going to go to a museum. Um, I think I'm at a place. Hold on. So I'm going to get Mexican. So let's go. museum I wanted to check it out can I admit something to you guys like as much as these shoes look comfortable they really hurt my feet and I don't know like I, I know that they hurt but I keep forgetting every time I don't wear them for a long time that they hurt as much as they do so had a nice little time um, I really want to I hope that this museum is worth the walking because it's not a lot of walking but given the fact that my feet hurt this much it feels like a long time um, so I'm headed there and I will of course show you guys what's happening uh, I think I turn right here yeah yeah so I hope that you guys have been enjoying this vlog as well don't forget to like and to comment your favorite part in the video as you guys know it's just me so 
I'm not able to get a ton of content or uh, that is pictures that I would be accustomed to taking my tripod can only do so much and no more and even when I ask people I don't want to take up too much of their time because they're there for their own business they're not my personal photographer so I'm always grateful though I got a few pictures not sure if I'm going to post them on my Instagram because they may not be up to my standard but I may post them on my insta story either way so people can see what I've been up to anyways walking talking to you guys actually so my feet don't hurt as much even though they still hurt but I will check in with you guys later basically going to have burger because um, I'm just not in the mood to, to do anything else so there's a, literally a burger spot like right across from the hotel so that's where I'm going right now to get something to eat so let's go hey guys I just sat down after taking off my well not take off my wig I still have I'm here after putting my hair up in my bonnet and everything that I didn't come on and show you guys or talk to you guys so you guys are gonna have to <laughs> see what is this right now we did not leave this in yokohama we brought it with us just came back from off the road and uh, yes i had a double <clears throat> a spicy double cheese burger with large fries and drink I don't know if it's because I was hungry, but that burger was so good. If you've had, if you live in Japan and maybe you've had Moss Burger, I don't know if they're an international brand or if it's a Japanese brand, but if you've had a Moss Burger, comment below and let me know which do you prefer, uh, uh, McDonald's over 
McDonald's or Moss Burgers. I like both, but I feel like Moss is like a bougie, bougie version of that. McDonald's in Japan is also very good. So if you if you're coming to Japan, that's something you could try out if you're interested. So after leaving there, I went to the supermarket, which is like a J in right in front of the Moss Burger. I grabbed a few things because last night, let me tell you something. This hotel comes with nothing. At the last hotel, they gave us complimentary tea and uh two bottles of water this hotel they were like yeah no <laughs> free wi-fi that's it but one of the things though even though this hotel is a little more expensive than the one that i went to that i was at for the last two days in kyoto this one is like three thousand yen more expensive not too much this hotel though has a onsen which i plan on taking full advantage of later on i'm going it's about 647 right now so i'm going to go to the antenna about 839 i'm going to go that late because what i want when i go there i don't want to see any kids i want to i don't want to see any kids so i'm hoping by then the kids will be asleep so to the grandmas yes they need to be in bed by the time i go down there mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so i came back um last night was hungry starving i was like this night this time i'm not going to torture myself like that so i stopped at the supermarket grabbed myself some yogurt i have not been eating very well on this trip i haven't been eating badly but I just haven't been eating as much I, i'm eating like twice a day which is very unusual for me also got myself some water two bottles of water because we have to stay hydrated um and i also got myself some cookies just in case i had the munchies last but certainly not least i got myself a hand cream because i don't want to buy a big a lotion because i have to pack my luggage when i'm going back and i already have extra things i'm going to have to take in account uh so i got this small one i already have one of these already and i've been using it on my legs but i bought another one because that one is finishing and we don't want to be ashy out here we don't want to be ashy no no that's not cute i'm gonna actually rub some on my leg right now because like i said the one i have is almost done uh so so far i do want to say i've been enjoying my time here in the kansai area hopefully you guys are enjoying the video that i've been putting out i have been trying to make it a little more to be honest if if i had the time well if i had the resources like i'm using iMovie right now it's not my favorite thing to to um what you might call it to edit on but it gets the job done I, I do prefer the software that i was using on my phone but the thing is i paid for it using my google store so now i have an apple obviously i have an apple id because i have a macbook but i can't use the same service because I, it's two different accounts does that make sense so if i wanted to use it again i would have to pay for it again and it's not expensive but i just don't want to pay <laughs> i just don't want to pay maybe if i get so frustrated with iMovie then i will do it but i hope that you guys have been enjoying i've been putting a lot more effort into this, this the, the, the storytelling of it all i want it to be something that people can sit down and watch and actually enjoy i know that a lot of people watch my vlogs because they're supporting me personally but i do want them to to watch it and and enjoy actually enjoy what they're watching and hopefully it will attract new people to my channel that's the aim that's the goal i really enjoy content creation i really enjoy editing in my videos and it just feels good when i'm finished and i know that yeah i i did that i really did that so i'm going to talk to you guys later there isn't, isn't anything planned for my narrow vlog uh except the hot spring and chicken out tomorrow but i will keep you guys abreast with whatever is happening and i will check in with you so i'm gonna go ahead start editing this video for you guys and relax and by the way before anyone says anything editing is relaxing to me so this is my idea of relaxation so oh, anyways guys talk to you later 
<laughs> I'm so stupid. Um, so I'm going to go to the auntie now because if I don't go, I'm going to fall asleep and I'm checking out tomorrow. And there's no way I'm going to miss out on a good auntie experience. So I'm not going to take my camera with me, but I might sneak in a little video. I don't know. Maybe I'll see how it goes depending on how populated it is. But if I don't, this is me letting y'all know that I did go to the onsen, so see ya.